Hi guys, Jennifer here with a brand new video. So about two weeks ago, I decided to take a trip to Rocky Point. And I said to myself, why not bring you guys along? This was first for me. Yes, it was my first time going to Rocky Point, even though I grew up on this island. So I did not know what to expect. It all began with us first stopping at the gas station to fill up the cart. And it only cost us 30 Belize dollars. An alternative would have been to take a boat, but maybe for the next time. We drove north and one thing I first realized was the bumpy roads. But luckily, I have my PhD that stands for Pothole Dodging. It's a skill. And then the farther you go north, I was surprised by the vast amount of development construction going on. We even passed grocery stores like four, the farthest one about nine miles north. And for a drink or two at the different spread out restaurants and bars along the way, you can call this bar hopping. Hence my shaky films here. <laughs> we pass a turn off to Secret Beach, other places like Mata Grande, Puerto Fino, and Safari. And then came Bright Waters, where I noticed that the road turned to drive through the beach. Not really, but the view did get better. I also quickly noticed that the farther we continued north, the closer the reef got. Back to the beach. It was beautiful scenery seeing the reef getting closer and closer to the shore. Or should I say, us getting closer to the reef. And about 13.5 miles north, just after Margaritaville, I noticed some tourists having a picnic by the beach. There were a few benches by the beach and the tour guides that were grilling, assuming it was fish, too bad I did not film it as we were just passing by. I will probably do that with some friends soon. At some point, I felt like I was on a jungle-like trip because of the vast amount of natural light that surrounded us and not to mention the trails we passed with thick vegetation. I couldn't tell if we were on the mainland or an island. Then again, I looked to the ground and it was sun. I guess if it was black dirt, then I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It was at this point I was hoping to see a wildcat or a deer. At least that's what the locals say we have on the north side of the island. As we approached Rocky Point, I noticed more birds by the shoreland and dilapidated dogs as we drove past them. Different signs were warning us to be careful not to run over turtles. I didn't see any, hopefully next time I do. And from a distance, I saw Rocky Point getting closer. I noticed no more reef, just dry land where the reef hits the shore. But the waves were hitting it pretty bad. Overall, it's a great experience, one I would recommend. Let us know in the comment section if you've been to Rocky Point before. Tell us what your experience was like or if you're planning to. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and share. And remember for all the things real estate believes, consider us. Some people think any real estate company will do. Others expect more.